Hey everyone, in today's video I'm answering a question that still comes up a lot. How do you install iTunes on macOS Sequoia? Here's the straight answer, you can't. Apple no longer supports iTunes on macOS Sequoia, and the tool we use to rely on to bring it back, Retroactive, has been discontinued. It doesn't work with Sequoia or any newer versions of macOS, which means the old workaround is officially dead. So, what now? Well, you actually don't need iTunes anymore. Apple has replaced it with a set of built-in apps that handle everything iTunes used to do, and even more. Instead of trying to bring back an outdated app, it's better to get familiar with these new tools. TV for watching your movies and shows, podcasts for audio content and episodes, books for reading and listening to audiobooks, and Finder, which now lets you sync your iPhone or iPad just like iTunes used to. These apps are all pre-installed and fully integrated into the latest Mac OS, offering a smoother and faster experience than the old iTunes ever did. So to wrap it up, iTunes is gone, Retroactive doesn't work on Sequoia, but Apple's built-in apps more than make up for it. If this video helped you understand what's changed, hit that like button and subscribe for more quick Mac tutorials. Got a question? Drop it in the comments and I'll get back to you. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.